Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is Helton's Computer Repair. If you're looking a way to remove your desktop wallpaper in Windows 10, if it's to pretty much avoid distractions from a wallpaper or sideshow, then you can actually turn the background image off on the desktop. And in this tutorial, we're going to be showing two different easy ways you can hide, or technically if you want to show the background image in Windows 10. Let's go ahead and get started. So first thing you do is there's a couple options. First one's going to be done by going to Control Panel and going to Easy Access Center. So let's go ahead and go to Start. And depending if you have the search bar or not, you would just have to start typing and it should appear. And we're going to do it and just type in Control right here. And pretty much Control Panel came up. I'm going to go ahead and select it. And most likely you probably have this newer layout. If it is already on the newer one, you can actually can change this to large icons to make this easier. And what we're going to really look for is just the Ease of Access Center. And most like if I click this, you might gonna hear some voice talking. Just ignore that. Always scan this section. All right, so here he is talking. I'm gonna go ahead and select to make this computer easier to use. That's gonna be the section we're looking for. And once you get to there, depending on your screen, if it's smaller, you might need to scroll down. Regardless, what we're gonna look for is to make things on the screen easier to see. And when you go to there, you see it says remove background images where available. So I'm gonna go ahead and check it and press apply and press okay. And most likely the thing might talk again. Always scan this section. So I'm pretty much done. I'm going to go ahead and just X this out. And now we have the background. It's pretty much a black screen and you don't see any background. So if you think that it might be just be, well, I could just put a, put a background on there, a black screen. It's actually not just a regular background color that's there. It actually literally disables the background that is turned off by ease of access settings. So that's pretty much an option. If you actually possibly see this issue, then that might have been the whole issue that you're seeing that. So reverse to this, you can, you can go back. Uh, we're going to do the same thing by going to start and going to search bar. And I'm going to go ahead and type in control. Actually, it's just on it right now. There it is. Control panel. And depending on it, it does remember. Again, it remembers what I just did right now. If it was, again, to the newer layout, just change it over to the large icons. Technically, I think you can go the same way by going to ease of access, but it's a couple extra steps. So I kind of just like to bring that, this section. the old classic layout. Regardless, you hear that voice again talking. Just ignore that. And we're going to go to make the computer easy to use. I'm going to go ahead and select it. And I'm going to go ahead and uncheck the remove background images and press apply and OK. And always scan this section. He was going to talk again. I'm going to go ahead and just X this out. And here is the background working perfectly fine again. Now, another way, if you don't want to do it the control panel, then it's fine. You can just do it the regular settings way. You can go to start. And once you get to you can select settings. And your layout might be a little bit different depending on it. If you have a smaller screen, regardless of what you're going to look for. Here on my right side, it says that we have the ease of access. Go ahead and select it. And we're going to go to the display. Be sure that it is selected where you're on there. And we're going to scroll down until you see show desktop image. Or you're going to just turn that off. And I'm going to minimize this down. And now we have it. If I pretty much go to personalize, it's pretty much disabled for that same concept. So there's two different ways you can get to it. And they both pretty much do the same thing. So if I want to bring it back again, just go to the settings and go ahead and go to ease of access. And I'm going to scroll down. Be sure you're underneath the display and just turn that back on and everything should be good. And that's all you really have to do. Thank you for watching from Helton's Computer Repair and I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching guys. If you just like this video, then hit that button. But if you like it and you want to see more, hit that like button. Get subscribed, comment, and tell us what other tech videos you want to see. Consider checking out our merch store. Link in the video description. And for the rest, I will see you on the next video.